So here we are in TextEdit's preferences. And one of the settings that I always choose in TextEdit, and you only have to do it once because these are the settings, the default settings for TextEdit for the individual user. I always turn on Wrap to Page. I suspect that the largest number of questions about using TextEdit have to do with the difference between wrapping to a page and wrapping to the window. You can also, in TextEdit, create two types of documents. You can create what is called rich text documents, and that's text that allows you to style it. And let me underline. I can make changes like this to a rich text document. And rich text is a common format that can be read by word processing programs like Pages from Apple or Microsoft Word. You also can create documents by default that are plain text and they only have in them the characters. They don't have any style information, so you can't underline. So if I come back here and change the document to plain text, you'll see that I'm going to lose the ability to underline, and if I want to provide emphasis, I use the time-honored method of capitalizing or some other form of emphasis. If you can, most of the time using rich text is a better choice, and you can set your default here in Preferences. You can also choose the default window size and the default fonts for plain text and rich text. Now, when you choose a default font for plain text, you are choosing the default font to display the text in. There is no style information, including font information, for plain text. So this preference here is only the font to use in displaying plain text, whereas the rich text font is the font that is encoded in the document. And you can put down here default information and again these are the preferences for the application they will be inherited by each document but you can override them and down here you have the ability to check spelling and grammar as you type and turn on these various smart options and as I go through the menu bar I will show you what these do and how you can use them. But what I wanted to do is to show you particularly the wrap to page and the plain and rich text font options here in preferences. And before going on, I want to also just go to the open and save preferences. The main thing that you should notice here is that you have the ability to auto save documents as you're going along so that the saved document will be continually saved and you don't have to worry about losing three hours worth of work. If you go off on a tangent or start to make a mistake and you say you do want to go back three hours, then you've got Time Machine that can take you back three hours.